I just can't let you go Lord knows that I've tried to You said I was the only one Hey everyone, this is Kelly from Empire Tarot. Yes, I am back doing your collective love readings. I will be here daily to do these love readings for you, any and all signs. All of you are welcome. Please do smash the like, subscribe button. If you are a new subscriber, if you are returning, welcome. So happy to see you all back here again. I will be uploading between 9 and 9.45 p.m. Eastern Time. If you want to get a personal reading, there will be a link in the description box below. Okay. Let's get into this. Hey, collective, we're going to do a collective reading for the week. Coming up, we're going to take a look at love, career, and life, and then see what the messages are for the week going forward. All right, let's get into this. What does the collective need to know? Starting with love, career, and then your life overall messages. Oh, I just want to get a little extra light here for you guys okay starting with love okay thinking about oh wow love looks great this week so you're kind of thinking about love this week whether or not to accept or make a love offer to someone this week or to reach out and say hi reach out and apologize or accept um an apology from someone um it looks no matter what whether accepting or giving, giving or receiving, it looks very positive. A lot of thought being put into this, this week going forward. Okay, Leo energy here showing up um, looks very positive. A lot of thought, kind of um, should I or shouldn't I is what I feel. Could be a text message, phone call, um, brings a lot of joy, reunion, happiness, looks very very positive the outcome i feel um, be a successful response or a successful um conversation that's had um it feels like some kind of i'm definitely with the page i feel like it's it's um it's a giving kind of an energy somebody reaches out or somebody like I don't know if it's you or another person or someone receives something very nice it feels usually a page of cups is my apology card it doesn't have to be an apology but it's it's be it's well thought out to talk to another person and um it could even just be a reach out flirtation kind of thing but sweet mild it could be a happy birthday it could be um just hey can I get your number it could be how have you been that kind of thing but it's a joyful it's, it's it'll make another person very happy an 11 11 kind of energy playing out here with the four of wands for some it's a reunion getting back together with someone for others it's getting together and having dinner it's a celebratory kind of energy love looks really great this week okay and I feel like it starts with the seven of pentacles so it feels like it starts off hesitantly which means for me that whoever receives this message is kind of like i wonder if someone's going to reach out and i wonder if i should respond it's kind of like hmm, should i or shouldn't i or whoever sends it is i wonder if i should send it i wonder if they'll respond it's a little bit of yeah that but once it's sent once it's received it goes beautifully after that so i like it i like it i like it whether no matter what can no matter what the content of the message is it, it flows very beautifully it brings happiness and joy so it's a it's a positive it's a positive response it's a positive initiation and and it, it turns out beautifully successfully okay it may even be an uh, an offer for um it could be a proposal it could be a marriage commitment type of an offer should i propose should i offer commitment it's it's like a yes okay so i love it <laughs> i mean it's i love it because it's positive it's very positive for for love okay so let's take a look at career let's see how your career pans out for this week Okay, you've got 
the death card. Huh. Okay, something's something's ended as far as career. Let's see. Or transitions. Wow, look at all that major arcana. Hmm. Um Okay, so there's definitely something comes to an end as far as a job. Okay? And there's a um, big dividend or big payout coming. Wheel of Fortune here. Definitely. That is quite a payout. Definitely. Big money being made. So it could be the sale of something. If you work in sales, if you work on any kind of projects com that gets completed, big money. Um, there's a lot of enthusiasm here about finding out how much money is going to be made this or how much money yeah is made from something or a big paycheck coming in finding out about a big paycheck um now i know this isn't related to career but somebody is going to find out about big inheritance that's coming to them or money that's being left to them um after um, someone has passed I'm not predicting death I always have to say that because people are like oh my god um, there's there's some like there's some money or someone's able to pay off some kind of a judgment of some sort but I have to like there's some news that I feel is is or there's a piece of mail or there's a direct deposit or there's some type of money that comes in after some project of some sort or some kind of job of some sort is finished you know and so i say this week so this is starting sunday because for me the week is sunday through saturday um so this is like happening now and i know by the time you get this you know there's like an hour like well on the, i'm on the east coast so by the time you get this we've got like an hour two hours left before monday starts okay but if you're on the west coast or back um You've got like three, four, five hours, but um, whatever. It, I don't know why I'm bringing that up. <laughs> but for me, it's starting Sunday through Saturday, okay? So the whole week. So there's good, like there's some money um, connected to your job, connected to your career, okay? And um, it's good. It's a lot. It's a good bit. You know, I mean, it, it may not be, I mean, the Wheel of Fortune It's a good bit of money. It's nice. It's going to make you feel good, you know? So I don't know what exactly you're getting paid for. I don't know what exactly you do for your career. Um, I mean, some of you might find buried treasure in the backyard, you know? Uh, maybe you're just that person that goes with one of those metal detectors out on the beach and you find buried treasure on the beach somewhere. That might be your job. I don't know. Maybe you take that up for a living. I don't know. You quit your job and that's what you're doing. Whatever it is, there's good money coming in this week. Small fortune. Some of you just like, you know, you grab a stick and you do a scratch off. Whatever it is, it's it looks positive. It's very good. Like your love life. So we also have, let me just point out some signs here. We've got double Scorpio. We have Aries, um, Aquarius. Um, Taurus yeah and I've already said Leo so if those are your signs uh, that's a little more specific to you but it could be for anybody as well okay so I just want to point that out there uh, somebody might be in the UK I just heard somebody could be you might live in the UK or in the Commonwealth you might be in the Commonwealth somewhere um, somebody might also be somewhere in the Middle East as well. Okay, let's move on to uh, life in general. Let's take a look. Life in general. Okay. Hmm, that's interesting. After all that, you've got the Five of Pentacles. Okay. So you've got the Empress in the reverse. Interesting. You've got the King of Cups and the Page of Swords. Hmm. Okay. 
Give me a second. This one's tough. Now you might be a water sign. You could also be a Libra or a Taurus, or you might have an attachment to a water sign. Okay. All right, let me just say this. So I'm getting a couple of different. There is someone. No, it's not someone. Oh, okay. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. All right, very, very straightforward message. This might not be for all of you, but they're just telling me you may need to help your mom out this week. I just heard if your mother's still alive or um, a mother figure, you may need to help her out this week with something. Could be like a sister if she, you know, she could be a mother figure. Um, I'm seeing a feminine who, I don't know, maybe she had surgery or she's just not feeling well or she's under the weather. You might help have to help her out with if she has a child or you might have to help her she has to go get some medicine or something um, I'm seeing a mother figure I'm seeing someone attached to her I'm seeing some ill health nothing serious like I'm not seeing like some, nobody's on their deathbed or anything like that but this is just life in general I see you being called to service to help someone out in life in general okay taking up like calling or asking what she's doing or how she's doing uh, seeking some answers she might be reaching out to you asking for help this week um, she might need help walking too I'm seeing there might be like she needs some help walking as well um, I am picking up like she just has to get she might need to get some blood work done or something or um, might, maybe it might just be giving her a ride to go somewhere that's really what I'm getting or she has to go to a doctor you know could be it could be your spouse could be a mother figure because um, the king of cups is showing here in the upright you know it could be a friend you might be helping um, another parent, something along those lines. There's a lot of curiosity, a lot of questions being asked. Are you okay? What can I help you with anything? Um, yeah. So I kind of feel like while you're busy getting all your money and your love life's going great, you're gonna have to pay it forward. <laughs> you have to help somebody else and you'll be in a great position to do it because your week looks fantastic for other areas of your life. Um, and I feel like I guess there's a caveat to all this great stuff happening for you this week. Um, so you're going to have to, looks like, try to help somebody else out. <laughs> yeah, I guess, I don't know. I mean, I don't really believe like, you know, okay, all this great stuff's happening to you. So now you're going to have to pay. I don't feel it works like that, you know, but it looks like, because um, I feel like you would probably help people out anyway, but it looks like you're in a good position, especially to help another person this week. Yeah. Okay, so I'm just going to leave that there. It was a very simple weekly message, and that's just what I was intuiting. So looks pretty good. I will see you all back here tomorrow. Have a great night. Take care. You said I was the only one. No one likes being like two. You made this mess and left me with the peace.